Good afternoon, all of you. So we are going to felicitation ceremony. Bikkevirla Institute of Engineering and Technology, Vilani. Gold medalist and topper students. The Honorable Chief Guest, Professor, respected Sudhir Kumarji Varai, Director of Wits Vilani, Vilani Campus. So program starting soon. So we are waiting of a chief guest and program suddenly started. So, chief guest have come. Welcome moment. Never director sir. Chief Guest Mansasini Smat. Seats. We shall begin the program shortly.
टू थ्री प्लीज टू ठीक है कितना आ रहा है मरीज ठीक है ठीक है गुड ऑडियो हो जा रही है हाँ A very good afternoon to the Honourable Chief Guest of the Felicitation Ceremony, Professor Sudhir Kumar Barai, Director, Mets Pilani, Professor Prasanna Kumar SM, Director, BKBI ET, Shri K. K. Parikh, GM Commercial, BKBI ET, Dr. Anil Kumar Sharma, Principal, BKBI ET, Dr. Bina Narayan, Principal, BKBI HE, Mr. Manoj Gaur, Principal, BGTI, Diploma Section, Captain J.P. Singh, Principal, BGTI, ITI Section, all the respected principals from renowned schools, prominent personalities from Pilani, dignitaries, faculty members, proud parents, and my dear friends. On behalf of the whole BKBI ET family, I, Aditya Sharma, and I, Kanika Parashar, feel proud and privileged to extend a warm welcome to you all on the momentous occasion of the felicitation ceremony of the university gold medalist, toppers, and meritorious students. Ladies and gentlemen, it is a great honor for us to be in the company of such dynamic personalities. So without further ado, let us begin the day's proceedings. 
Running in the process, I request our director, sir, to kindly welcome our chief guest, Professor Burai, with a bouquet of flowers. Thank you so much, sir. Now I request Shri K. Parikh, sir, to kindly welcome the prominent personalities. We have Shri Ashok Tola, manager, Raja Pilla Haveli, Pilani. Shri R. Pidara, Samaj Sevi, Pilani. Shri Jagdish Prashad Sarma, Founder, PPS Pilani. Shri Manish Agarwal, CA Jhanjunu. Shri Pavan Jakodia, Samaj Sevi, Pilani. Shri Maturam Verma, Murtikar Pilani. Mr. Suman Mishra, Chairperson, Shri Mati Jamuna Mishra School Pilani. Shri Hira Lal Nayak, Chairman, Pilani Nagar Palika. Shri Rotas Ranwa, Kamlesh Ranwa, Chairman, Vidya Vihar Nagar Palika Pilani. Thank you so much, sir. May I now ask Principal, sir, to kindly welcome our guests. Dr. Bina Narayan, Principal, BKBIHE. Mr. Manoj Gaur, Principal, BTTI, Diploma Section. Captain J.P. Singh, Principal, BTTI, ITI Section. Mr. Sat Satyavi Jangi, Director, Tagore Senior Secondary Public School, Bilani. Sri S.C. Bora, Principal, Other School, Bilani. Mr. Aditya Saragoy, Principal, R.K. Birla School, Bilani. Dr. Bhuman Atrajan, Srimati Jamuna Mishra Academy, Bilani. Mrs. B. Rachel, Principal, Siri Vidya Mandir, Bilani. Mr. Amit Sharma, Principal, Bajna Sri Ram Sabu, Senior Secondary School, Bilani. Mrs. Manisha Saini, Principal, Shri Gayatri Senior Secondary School, Chand Goti. Mr. Rakesh Gaur, Principal, Ma Bharti Senior Secondary School, Chirava. Dr. Ashu Singh, Principal, Seth Senior Secondary School, Padagaon. Mrs. Punita Sharma, Principal, Durga Public School, Pilani. Mr. Gauri Shankar Sharma, Principal, Pariskar Senior Secondary School, Junjuru. Dr. Bina Narayan, Principal, BKBIHE. Mr. Ratpal Sharma from the Rajasthan Patrika.
मिस्टर श्यामलाल इंदौरिया दैनिक भास्कर मिस्टर लोकेंद्र शेखावत ईटीवी राजस्थान आसपास मिस्टर अनिल कालिया पिलाने की आवाज मिस्टर पवन कुमार वर्मा शिखावटी समाचार मिस्टर बाबूलाल गोगालिया निर्दोल पत्रिका मिस्टर आलोकेश सेन प्रिंसिपल बीपीएस पिलानी श्री हीरालाल नायक चेयरमैन पिलानी नगर पालिका थैंक यू सर्स इट इज अ ट्रेडिशन दैट ऑल द फंक्शंस एंड इवेंट्स कमिंग्स विद लाइट ऑफ लैम as the light is a symbol of brightness and purity now i request our honorable chief guest to kindly come forward for the auspicious lamp lighting ceremony as a tribute to ma saraswati the goddess of knowledge and wisdom i also request our director sir and dignitaries to kindly mark their offering to ma saraswati I thank all the dignitaries. It is a matter of honor for me to read a brief about our honorable chief guest, Professor S K Barai. Professor Barai is a director and senior professor of civil engineering at Bits Pilani. He is also a professor in the Department of Civil Engineering, IIT Kharagpur, availing lean for the current position. Professor Barai has obtained his PhD in engineering from the Indian Institute of Science, Bangalore, and the degrees of bachelor's and master's of engineering in civil, with specialization in structural engineering from the Faculty of Engineering, MS, University of Baroda. He was the Erskine Visiting Fellow at the University of Canterbury, Christchurch, New Zealand, during the months of May, June, 2008. 
He was also the visiting, visiting scientist at National University of Singapore during the months of May to July 2003. He was the recipient of the Boy Scouts Fellowship and visited Department of Civil and Environmental Engineering, Carnage Mellon University, Pittsburgh, USA during the months of May to November 2000. He was a postdoctoral fellow at the Department of Solid Mechanics, Materials and Structures at the Tel Aviv University, Israel from February 1997 to July 1998. Professor Barai has published more than 240 papers in leading international journals and conferences and various books on concrete fracture models and application, shear strengthening of T-beam with GFRP and the characterization and behavior of recycled aggregate concrete, all of which have been published by Springer. His field of expertise are green technology, recycled construction materials, computational techniques, fracture mechanics, sensi sensitivity analysis, damage assessment methodologies, MEMS applications, computer-aided engineering, artificial intelligence, knowledge-based expert systems, fuzzy logic and neural networks, and internet-based applications in engineering problems. It is indeed an honor for all of us to be in the company of such a distinguished personality, a fountainhead of distinct vision and illuminating ideas, our chief guest, Professor S.K. Barai. Now I request Director Sir, Parikh Sir and Principal Sir to kindly felicitate our chief guest. Thank you, sir. I would like to request Parik, sir, to invite CA Manisha Garwal, Junjunu. Thank you, sir. Now, I request Vaishnavi Nair to present the Ganesh Vandana.
Thank you so much, Vaishnavi. May I now request Principal Sir to kindly welcome Mr. Jagdish Joshi from PPS, of which he is the founder. Thank you so much, sir. Moving forward, it is really a matter of pride for me to request our director, sir, for his welcome address. Please, sir. Well, uh, very good afternoon to one and all. On this uh, prestigious and auspicious day for us, BKBIT, that felicitation ceremony for the gold medalists of Bikaner Technical University in the Department of Mechanical, Mr. Manish and uh, Ms. Prerna have got the colors brightness shining to the institute making all of us very proud about them and the reason behind such an achievement by default to say our teachers our team faculty members have done great such along with us we have the toppers also next to the gold medalists of other departments we have toppers with us we have invited them. They are also gathered here. So at this juncture, respected chief guest of today's function, Barai sir, the other invited principals of different colleges and Sri Alok Tola, Sri R.P. Dada, Sri Jagdish Prasad Sharma, Sri Manish Agrawal, Sri Pawan Jakodia, Sri Manuram Verma, Dr. Suman Mishra, Sri Himalal Nayak, Rotas Rawa Ranwa. Feel very happy to welcome you all for this program. And my dear students and teachers, are responsible for this program and they have made this program a colorful one because of getting such gold medals. To highlight few points of our institute, we have good collaboration with different universities through N plus I program. Europe countries, nearing 50 universities, we have MOE with 12 universities. And in Thailand program also, in Thailand universities also we have programs to run through for the students. We have in this internship programs, student exchange program, research exchange program, at the same time to pursue master's degrees also. And we have one other option, like out of two years master's degree, one year they can do at BKBIT and next second year they can do at uh, uh, the universities of Europe and Thailand. So this has really brought us the name and fame for the institute, making such students pursue their masters there, research there. And another five or six days after this, two students from Europe country are visiting to this campus for a internship program for six months. So they stay with us, programs have been already planned. Similar way, university also has recognized us that we are in the rank level which we were 16th position earlier so now after getting all these achievements and all that now we are in the rank a position 
and to call like we are in the third position of the university. The institute is in the third position. So this is how we have progressed through. And to add on to this, we have got the accreditation for the computer science program. And of course, the recent emerging areas, two programs we have taken up and other new PG programs and UG programs we have applied for this time to get the extension of approval from All India Council for Technical Education. So these are the some the achievements of ours are the progress that we have seen since uh, two, three years. So just thought of putting in front of you all. And extending a warm welcome to one and all for this uh, prestigious program of BKBIT and request all of you to bless us further to progress in this same field. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, sir, for your welcoming words. Now, I request our principal, sir, to share a brief about the Institute, international collaborations and placements. Please, sir. So good afternoon everyone on behalf of B, B, on behalf of BKBIT this is Dr. Anil Kumar Sharma principal as your host for this evening and extend a warm welcome hearty welcome to all of you present over here it is my pleasure to share and celebrate the achievements and talents of the outstanding performance showcased by the students of our institute. On this eve, I would like to express my gratitude to the parents and teachers who have made a lot of efforts in developing and finalizing the personality of the young talents present over here in this evening. BK Bill Institute of Technology is one of the premier industry-oriented and application-driven institute in India. It was established in 2007 under the chairmanship of renowned industrialist Mr. Basant Kumar Birlaji. The institute has been true to its commitment in the providing quality education in engineering and technology. Our strong alliances with leading international universities, industries and professional bodies have increased access to latest education opportunities for exchange of collaborative research and innovations among students and faculty members. We believe the best way to help PKBDIT BKBITians is to provide a supportive and enriching environment for their overall development of their career. Our students proved their ability in the academics as well in extracurricular activities like sports, music, artwork, hackathon, etc. They made us proud with their tremendous growth and achievements. Now I will introduce you about the bird. It is not a flying bird, it is the department of our college, our institute. This stands for BKBIT International Relations Division. The institute has collaborative arrangements in terms of exchange of students, faculty and information with several institutions abroad. Our this special department board headed by Mr. Gaurav Sahu and Dr. Sonam Mittal was inaugurated in 2011 with the objective of encouraging students to embrace global exposures. Bird helps internships, research options, job opportunities abroad in the field of engineering technology for students after completion of bachelor's degree, Con counseling on higher education, getting their visas, scholarship have al always been available for BKBIT students through BIRD. So far we hold 12 collaborations with various universities in France, Thailand and few more from European universities are in process. BKBIT exchanges students and French and Thai universities twice a year for two month in internship in the month of Feb and March and September and October. Till date, 277 students from BKBIT has visited different universities and under this section program and 2003, sorry, 203 students from different international universities has also visited our BKBIT. Along with the students, many faculty members also have gone for foreign universities for visit. 17 faculty members have visited French universities and 13 faculty members have visited Thai universities under the same exchange program of faculty and students. BKBIT also runs 
French language program in collaboration with IFI Jaipur. BKBIT also holds collaboration with Network N plus I. Network N plus I brings together about 50 French engineering institutions of higher education who have chosen to who has chosen to mutualize their international cooperation efforts to attract and welcome high caliber foreign students who will be the future for top executive in French and foreign companies over the world. Now placement BKPIT, the highest number of companies visited per 118 like Infosys, IBM, TCS, Synopsys and so many branded companies including Aditya, Birla Group, Josh Technology etc. Recruiters from 8 different sectors have visited this institute. Opportunity with highest package was 20 LPA, 20 lakhs per annum. Average package was 4.5, 4.8 LPA. Medium package 4.5 LPA. Recruiters with more than 10 LPA package came to our institute for 8. Recruiters with more than 5 to L 10 LPA was 45 and 3 to 5 LPA 57. At last, I thank you all for coming together in this ceremony and adding more grace to it. Best wishes for all and thank you very much. Thank you so much, sir. May I also request Principal Sir to kindly welcome Mr. S. C. Vora, Principal Adarsh Senior Secondary School, Pilani. forward. Now I call upon Yashashvi to present her performance.
Thank you so much, Payal. Now for the moment we all have been waiting for, I would like to give you a brief introduction of our university toppers, our seniors, Ms. Prerna and Mr. Manish. Ms. Prerna has graduated from the IT branch at BKBIET with a university gold medal and a score of 90.82%. She has secured Air 883 in GATE 2022. She is currently working at Bamboo Box as an associate since September 2022. Prior to her current position, she has worked as an associate and also as an engineering intern at Symphony Talent. Her prime projects include a chatbot, come expression recognition system, a virtual assistant and a book reading app. Her technical skills include proficiency in the AWS Lambda, MySQL, Android Studio, TypeScript, Python, and frameworks like Flask and Node.js, amongst others. Congra congratulations, Ms. Prerna, for your achievements. Now, I take pride in reading a brief about another gem, Mr. Manish Kumar. Mr. Manish Kumar, from the branch of Mechanical Engineering, has passed out from BKBIT Pilani in 2022 with an aggregate of 96.7% along with the University Gold Medal. He is currently working as a GET at Larson & Turbro, Surat. Before stepping into BKBIT, he has been awarded for being the school topper in RBSC board examination of class 10th and 12th. His arrays of projects include an air pistol assembly, mini solar power plant, valve assembly and power hammer utilizing his interest in 3D design and automotive engineering. Mr. Kumar's technical skill encompass the language of C and essential softwares like AutoCAD, SolidWorks, and CATIA. Congratulations, Manish, on your achievements. May I now invite Ms. Prerna on stage to share with us her words of wisdom. I'm not a very stage person, so please bear with me. Uh, it's been very pride and honor for me to be here. Okay, so before I start my speech, are there any specific questions that I should answer? Or is there something in your mind that you want to know? Nothing? Okay, so I will start my journey like how I have uh, come to this college and how everything happened. So I came to this college through Bhupendra sir. He might not be here right now, but I owe this success to him. He's the one who was with me at every stage. Like he used to have this. And when those people come, I have to answer their queries. And the best thing that worked for me is uh, whatever you know, you should teach other those who need help or uh, you think like uh, you can help them. So that is the thing that has been helped me uh, the most. So the most uh, like ask question to me on the LinkedIn, like everyone asked me like how did you manage gate and your placement and your study all together. So let me clear that I was lucky enough that uh, in second year and third year, COVID was there, everyone was working from home. So it was pretty easy for me to manage everything, uh, like studying, like uh, for the gate also, Mr. Bhupendra sir, he was not here. So he called me one day and he asked me like, okay, you should start preparing for gate. And I was like, okay, it's COVID, everyone is enjoying, I should do the same, why should I study for GATE? I'm doing some, I was working on some project. So I thought like I should not waste my time on that. And then again he called next day, like have you prepared, started preparing for GATE? And like, okay, now I have to do it. So he's the external factor, like he's always behind me with his stick, like always. So whatever the score that I gained, then I start, gradually started gaining interest, uh, studying GATE. So that's how it happened. Uh, my uh, concepts become very strong by GATE, which helped me in the placements. And uh, once GATE is done, like I have uh, plenty of time to prepare for my uh, coding skills. So yeah, that is how all this happened. And uh, I must say, like uh, it's all because of the teachers and the students. Uh, I owe so much of my things, like my mindset. That is the most important thing to 
Uh, Anupama ma'am, I guess she might be there at the backstage who used to teach us math. And uh, yeah, and Sona ma'am sitting uh, in front of us, uh, in front of us, Gopal Krishna sir, and everyone who has taught me like this, this, this has been great. Uh, like I, I never used to bunk classes because they used to study so good and if you I, I just do one I used to do just one thing I just take classes like it's not like I always study I always go to the room and start studying because I used to play basketball also so I have to get back to the practice so the most important thing that I used to do at my time was just to focus in the class and I guess it is the, it's the great teaching of the teachers that has bring these gold medals to the institute so yeah, that's that's all from my side. I, I guess I uh, this is a uh, huge thanks to all the teachers, principal, director, sir, and everyone who has been involved in this, and especially Mr. Uh, Mr. Ritesh Gautam sir, who is always <laughs> hello sir, who is uh, who is uh, he's been great supporter when it comes to like placements. Like if it's a placement season, Ritesh Gautam sir will put all his efforts to bring all those companies, and he will make sure that you will get into some good college. Sorry, in some good company. So thank you, thank you so much, guys. Thank you. Is there anything anyone wants to ask me? Nothing. Chal. Okay. Bye. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Miss Prerna, for your motivating words. Now I'd like to take this opportunity to invite Mr. Manish Kumar to kindly come up to the dais and speak a few words. So hello everyone, respected teachers as my colleagues. So I am also not a stage person. The only time I came on stage is to just sing and didn't used to say anything or anything. So maybe Hindi will work? Okay. So if uh, I start my January, if I see how to come to college, then first of all, when I was doing preparation for GE, I dropped my year and then prepared for GE. But uh, maybe some sort of less marks, uh, IIT, IIT is not but then I got to know about this college because it has some good experience over here and I got some reference from my one of my colleagues or my friends you can say ki wo bhi yahan nearby study kiya hua tha to fir yahan pe aaya atmosphere dekha like it was everything good and then mechanical engineering mein lena tha to workshops dekhi sari machines and all and i thought like it's a good opportunity here we can work here maybe so my journey started at first year sab sab common branches thi to ek basic idea sab cheez ka liya कि प्रोग्रामिंग कैसे है इलेक्ट्रिकल वर्क कैसे करते हैं साथ साथ में मैकेनिकल का सीख ही रहे थे एंड देन सेकंड ईयर आया मैन्युफैक्चरिंग में थोड़ा ज़्यादा इंटरेस्ट बढ़ा और साथ साथ में मैं हमारा जो मैकेनिकल का ज़्यादा डीसी सर हैं रविंदर सर चित्रंजन सर रोहिला सर सबका बहुत अच्छा सपोर्ट मिला उन सब ने एकदम टेक्निकल बैकग्राउंड जो भी जिस तरीके से होता है कि कैसे मशीन्स वर्क करती हैं कैसे उसमें हर चीज़ का मतलब रोल होता है हर एक एक्यूरेसी और प्रिसीजन हर चीज़ में मैकेनिकल में बहुत ज़्यादा ज़रूरी है अदरवाइज मशीन्स में भी वॉन्ट वर्क प्रॉपरली देन कोविड आ गया सब एकदम बिखर सा गया और साथ साथ में मैकेनिकल में होने के बाद इंडस्ट्रियल एक्सपोजर बहुत ज़्यादा ज़रूरी है तो वो नहीं मिल पाया तो मैं सोचा कि अगर ये नहीं तो अपन डिज़ाइनिंग की तरफ चलते हैं तो टू डी डिज़ाइनिंग से शुरू किया ऑटो कैड में देखा इंटरेस्ट लिया एंड देन धीरे 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 थ्री डी डिज़ाइनिंग फिर खुद के शौक से ही एक अपने आप का हॉबी बन गया कि इसमें और अच्छा परफॉर्म कर सकते हैं या फिर इसमें और अच्छा तो मशीन्स बनाना चालू की आसपास की चीज़ें जो थी उसको इमेजिन करना चालू किया कि ये कैसे सॉलिड वर्क्स में बन सकती हैं कैसे डिज़ाइन हो सकता है इनका देन धीरे धीरे फोर्थ ईयर आ रहा था इंटर्नशिप्स एंड इसके लिए भी देख रहे थे सो इंडस्ट्रियल एक्सपोजर के लिए भी देखा एंड विद डैट एकेडमिक्स का चालू रखा गेट के लिए प्रिपरेशन भी की थी बट मे बी नहीं हो पाया उसमें <laughs> तो उसके अलावा 
देन इन दी एंड थैंक मतलब सब टीचर्स का इतना अच्छा सपोर्ट था लाइक like, एंड में जब हम मैकेनिकल का प्रोजेक्ट बनाए थे पावर हैमर का तो हमको कभी कोई रोक टोक नहीं करी जिस भी टाइम हम आते थे जिस भी टाइम हम जाते थे हमको जो भी मटेरियल प्रोवाइड करना होता था या जो भी है सब आराम से इजीली प्रोवाइड करते थे एंड देन उसके लिए भी थैंक यू सर कि किसी भी तरीके का कोई ना खर्चा आया है ना क्या एंड देन एवरी थिंग प्रोवाइडेड फॉर फ्री कि हमने प्रोजेक्ट बनाया एंड देन इट वॉज वर्किंग एज वेल एंड वी गॉट सम गुड अप्रिशिएशन फॉर दैट एंड उसके बाद आई गॉट आई गॉट पोस्टेड इन लार्सन एंड टूब्रो एल एन टी एवरी वन नो ए बिग मैनुफैक्चरिंग कंपनी एंड नाउ आई एम वर्किंग देयर एज अ ट्रेनी एंड उस मुकाम तक पहुँचाने के लिए यहीं से जो था वो एक बेस बना एक प्लेटफॉर्म बना सो उसके लिए थैंक यू एवरी वन ऑल माई टीचर्स एंड ऑल माई फ्रेंड्स एंड हु आर नॉट हेयर मे बी बट हॉस्टल के जो वो मज़े किए या फिर वो जो सब थी तो उसी की वजह से यहाँ तक पहुँचे हैं कि सेल्फ डिपेंडेंट भी बने एंड आगे और भी बढ़ाना है थैंक यू एवरी वन थैंक यू मनीष now it is time for the most pre prestigious moment for our institute the felicitation of our university gold medalist for which i request our chief guest professor barai director sir gm commercial sir and principal sir to kindly come on the stage to felicitate both of our the university toppers ms prerna and mr manish i also invite their parents to come on the stage and to be a part of this proud moment give them a huge round of applause I also request Bina Ma'am, Manoj Sir, and JP Sir to kindly be a part of this moment with us on the stage. I now request our chief guest to kindly give away the prizes for the bronze stoppers of the 2022 batch. The students and also the parents available. 
and our presenter kindly come up to receive the awards. Isha Rutla, CS Branch, 9.46 EGPA. We have a mother with her. Here. Congratulations, ma'am. We now have Sakshi Bansal, CS Branch, 9.37 CGPA. We also have a parents with us here today. We have Shaker Prajapati Electrical Branch with 8.56 eGPA. We also have his parents here with us today. We now have Ms. Muskan Rathor, EC, ran for the CGPA of 9.51. We have her father with her, with us here today. We also have Mohammad Javed, electrical branch of 8.5 ACGPA. He is not with us here today because of his SSB medical round for the officer's entry in the army. We have Ms. Kanchan Tower, EC branch with a CGPA of 9.35 percentile. We have a father with us here today and also her mother. We have Ms. Prerna from the IIT branch, the CGPA of 9.61. We have her, her parents with us here today. We have Ms. Shreya Tewari from the IIT branch with a CGPA of 9.25. We have Ms. Manish Kumar from the ME branch with a CGPA of 9.67. Now, 
Mary Quiz, our chief guest to felicitate our well-placed alumni for which I call Kumud Sultania. Father is also here with us today. Kirti Kushwaha Vivek Bharadwaj We also have his mother with us today. He is not here with us right now. And this year, 70 reputed recruiters visited our institute and a 100% placement has been achieved for all the eligible students. Respected guests, it is with great pride that I share with you I would like to call on stage our placement officer, Mr. Ritesh Gautam. Good evening everyone. We have in our presence our alumni from the 2015 pass out batch, for which I would like to call upon Mr. Akut Tibriwal, currently working at Barclays, New York. He is working currently at the Barclays at New York. We have Bhavak Agarwal currently working at CS Holding, Pune. We have Pradeep Maheshwari currently working at Plural Site, Bengaluru. <laughs> we have Sakshi Gupta currently working at Value Momentum, Hyderabad. We have Tanya Sittagi, who is currently working at Agile Pune. <laughs> we 
We have Vaisudha Sharda currently working at the NAV back office, Jaipur. We have Shivani Goyal currently practicing as a Meru Chikitsa practitioner and, that, and as an art of living teacher. organized by Google Developer Student Clubs PQBIT. The Zenith Hacks was a 24-hour coding event where students competed in teams of up to four to win competition. The hackathon was an open innovation where students were encouraged to solve real-world problems through code. We saw participation from 42 students in 13 teams. The winners of the events are the first place team Dan coders. Ashish Kumavat from AI third year, Chetan Surekha from AI third year, Ari Kumar, IT third year, and Thea Jrutla, CS third year. Please come on the stage. On stage, the jury members for the hackathon, Dr. Nimish Kumar, Dr. Hasibur Rahman, Mr. Himan Shubharma, Mr. Gautam Jangi, and Mr. Ramakan Soni. I'd also like to call on stage Mr. Y. K. Dr. Y.K. Gupta, Head of Department, Applied Sciences and Humanities, and Dr. Smita Parikh, Head of Department, Electrical Engineering, to kindly join us on stage. I'd also like to call upon Dr. D.C. Pandey, HOD of Mechanical Engineering Branch, to kindly join us on stage.
I'd like to call on stage Mr. D.C. Sharma, Head of the Department of Mechanical Engineering Branch. I'd like to call on stage Ms. Sakshi Parik, a pass out from the 2022 batch, to kindly, to kindly join us on stage. She is presently working at HCL Tech. She has joined us here with her father. Now I'd like to call on stage the student coordinators for the hackathon, Abhinandan Yadav, Anirudh Sharma, Raghav Saxena, Ojas Sharma, Anurag Jangir, myself Paditya Sharma and myself Kanika Parashar. Also, I would like to call upon the faculty coordinators, uh, Dr. Nimish Kumar and Mr. Himanshu Baba. Guys, please, uh, I'm not hearing any applauses. Thanks a lot. I'd like to thank Ritesh sir for kindly taking over while we were busy with the pictures. Thank you sir. We now have, I take this opportunity to call on stage the faculty coordinators for the Ramas 2023, the conference of recent advancements in mathematical and allied sciences. I call on stage Dr. Vaike Gupta, coordinator Ramas, Dr. Vipin Kumar, convener, Dr. Anupama Sharma, organizing secretary, Dr. Vikas Taylor, organizing secretary.
Now I'm going to call on stage our alumni from the 2015 Pass Out Batch to kindly address the audience. I request one of you to kindly come up and speak a few words. We are honored to be here today and it's a coincidence that we are here. <laughs> it was lovely to be the part of this felicitation ceremony. And thank you Director Sir, thank you Principal Sir for having us here. Thank you so much ma'am. This is to inform you our alumni from the 2015 Pass Out Batch surprised us with their presence here with Mr. Tipriwal flying in from New York today. Let us welcome them with a huge round of applause. May I now request our chief guest to kindly address the audience. First of all, uh, I would like to thank uh, Aditya and Anika for comparing the program so well and it's going as per schedule. So give them a big round of applause. One more thing, DKBRI people are both confused. Talia Marne Me All the medalists and toppers and all the successful achievers I you did not give a big round of applause. I think that let us do it now, even if it is not late. This is my first visit. Uh, Professor Prasanna Kumar, thank you so much for inviting me on this occasion. It's a wonderful time to be here uh, at uh, BKBIT. Just in the neighborhood of a bit Spilani, but uh, still it's uh, wonderful to be here. Uh, I was just thinking what am I going to talk here today? Okay, so I just said that a Hindi film was made in the jungle. But more Nacha has seen a lot of people in the jungle. I think that... And I heard that he was going to go to New York. And this is amazing that uh, to see that the, the institute uh, which has produced the alumni and also the producing still the great achievers, poppers and all other graduating students from this institute. I have been in the institute uh, on various institutes on various occasions. I also come from a very humble uh, institute. I am not a uh, kind of a great achiever in my life. Sometimes I was feeling jealous while handing over the gold medal trophy to these guys that uh, I did not get any time in my life. I am not a topper, I am not a gold medalist. I am coming from a very, very ordinary background. But having said that, uh, let me just tell you that any institution is made based on the three pillars of any institutes. One is the, the faculty members, the staff, and the most important is the students. And if the students are not there, the existence of the faculty and the staff is nowhere. So I think, let us give a big round of applause to self only, because the students are there, the institute is there. Uh, always I keep telling that the students bring the energy, the freshness, and the, the kind of a new environment that they bring in to the, any academic institution is beyond imagination. Uh, when I was doing my PhD that time, uh, somebody asked me, that why did you come for PhD? I said it was by chance, accident, I didn't get a job. I did not have a placement officer like what you guys have that who could get me a job. So I ended up doing a PhD. But then later on I realized it that being a part of an academic institute uh, always keeps you very young, very young at heart. Because of very simple reason that a professors like us uh, who will see always the crowd of between 18 to 22 year old throughout our life, throughout until we retire, we see the only young generation coming in, maybe the card punching, the floppy days, 
now smartphone and next what not, I don't know. But all this generation which brings in a very new value. Uh, I'm very happy that the, uh, the people who have been a very greatly successful in their academics, they have been recognized. So heartiest congratulations to Prerna and Manish and all other toppers. Uh, because Prerna Nami bolta hai ki Prerna, inspiration. Logo ko inspire karengi. And that is something which is a very good name. And of course Manish, uh, well spoken. I really appreciate that they, uh, you came down to the roots. And the roots are very important that never ever forget that your mother tongue and how you communicate. English is a medium, but finally end of the day what it matters that you connect with your roots. Okay, so this is something which is very good. You kept it that alive. Uh, just, I can go on and talking, but I don't want to do that. Uh, but I just want to tell the, uh, the graduating students, uh, it's not necessarily always to be on the top word and good ways. I'm not saying that you should not be. You should be striving always for an excellence. You should be doing whatever you're doing with all passion and drive so that you can do much better than what you have been doing it. And you must see the dreams. You must see the dreams which can make you to scale many times. Basically, you but the sapna is a deco, ki jisse aapko bhi lage ki, yes, something which is, I'm going to do something differently. Uh, because I'm telling from my own experiences and that's why I'm just sharing with you. That we uh, try to see the dreams where not only you see the growth and evolution of your personal, professional and personal life. Look at beyond that. Create the societal impact. What you can do through your own achievements. This particular town has that, that basis, the foundation. Uh, you go anywhere, any part of the world and if you say you are studying in a Pilani, immediately the next word which will get connected to is a Birla. And the name Birla itself is an indicator that the philanthropy, the dedication, the importance of education and how you can make the change into the, the lives of the people, that is something which is very important. Today I must say that the BKBIT has really contributed so immensely that I saw very uh, the people who achieved in their life, their parents, I could see my parents in them because they come from a very humble background and every educated individual transforms the lives of the people who come from a very simple background and that I've seen myself so I'm sure that those things will happen in the life. I just want to tell a couple of more things before I just close it that every graduating student must keep it two, three things in mind. One thing, I think there is no replacement for hard work. Absolutely, you must do hard work any point of time. Number two is very important what I always say, honesty. You should be honest to yourself. Whatever you are doing it in your life, just be very honest to yourself. And integrity is unquestionably is a more important thing because people will look at you that whether are you honest, integrity, has an integrity and you are sincere about your work, then you will get a recognition. And that is what I always say. There is always the, the light at the end of the tunnel. You will go through a lot of ups and downs, but those and ups and downs is just a part of the life. Best thing is that like a roller coaster, enjoy the ride. Alright? And just cheer, just shout, loud shout, and then you just keep enjoying that moment. Last, in a closing, I just want to convey to all of you is that take a pledge today. Take a pledge for yourself that every graduating student, be it a top or gold medalist or any graduate student of this institute, take a pledge for yourself. Don't have to tell anyone. You will just keep it with yourself. That whenever and wherever it would be possible by you, make the charity or a donation for an underprivileged child who can get an education. Because this education has changed your life. I'm sure you can change the life. I don't, I'm not saying that you won't teach to break up the million students. I'm not saying that. Even if you take a one child, if you take a place yourself, whenever it is possible, I'm not saying today, maybe down the line, 10 years, 20 years, 15 years, down the line, whenever you feel like doing that, please do that. That's the most satisfying thing. That day you will remember that what I told in BKBIT graduation or the felicitation ceremony that what it means actually. So, once again, heartiest congratulations to all the achievers, uh, heartiest congratulations to all the parents, and heartiest congratulations to 
director and principal of the, the institute and all the teachers who have worked very, very hard. And I could see the tempo of your placement in charge because he feels very happy about all the guys getting placed. I can see the numbers, the average salaries and things like that. It's an amazing thing. So I wish you a very grand success of the, the future and also this institute. Uh, keep achieving very, very high and wish you all the best. Thank you so much for inviting me. Thank you so much, sir. I'd like to request the program coordinator, Dr. Smita Parik, HOD, Electrical Engineering, for the vote of thanks. Please, ma'am. Your 
is evident in your achievements today. Thank you, thank you for joining today. Uh, this is the time now to thank the rock support solid system behind these, the parents of these students and the faculty of BKBIT. Because of them, they have taken up this thing and they have achieved these things. So I thank you, all the faculty members of BKB Institute of Engineering and Technology, as well as the parents of these students. Thank you very much for joining us today. Uh, the media person, I really thank you for giving the excellent coverage to our institute. Thank you so much. Uh, at last, I must say, all those students which are sitting behind and looking forward on this particular stage, I wish one day you all come here and achieve this particular moment, this cherish this particular moment with all of us. One day you all people would be the rank holders of BKBIT. Wishing this, thank you everyone for joining us. Thank you so much. Thank you, ma'am. Now I request all our guests to kindly join us for the high tea in the Gandhi Gallery. Thank you, everyone. Along with the guest, I also request the students to kindly join us for the IIT. The students, your high tea is prepared in the lawn behind. Kindly have it there. The guests, please join us in the Gandhi Gallery.